Hello, my friends. The Seashell here. Welcome back to the channel. I am coming on today to share with you a haul. Uh, a couple of things I picked up while I was out of town. I had the opportunity to go to Daiso. And for you guys who uh, have the Daisos in your location, uh, you know they always have these very, you know, just unique things. So whenever I get an opportunity um, to shop, I always like to go and see what new things they have. So, uh, I am sharing with you, uh, this is all about like their bags and stationery and just some other little odd, odds and ends things that I did pick up. Uh, so I will jump right into, uh, what I got. So, first of all, um, I got this shopping bag because I needed something to carry everything that I purchased back. And I like what it says. Anything worth doing is worth overdoing. And I think as crafters, we can all relate to that or even shopping. So, I had fun while I was there. So, let me uh, show you a couple of things or a few things that I picked up. Um thought that these were so unique these are the compressed tiles and what you do is you take one of these little they look like little peels here a little but but they're actually tiles and you wet them and then you just uh refresh your face and um they they're compact there and so you can throw a few of these like in your uh your purse and just have you know a refreshing face uh, <laughs> uh on the go so i got one of these and then i got the there's another one this one is called the facial and mask these are the compressed ones so this uh has uh let me see what i trying to think if there was anything that was different than the other one uh, which i don't i don't really think it is Oh, yeah, this one actually has the eyes, you know, the, the cutouts for, you know, your nose and your mouth and your eyes, whereas this one is just a tile. So I thought that that was really fun. And then I picked up this little cute little tea towel, and it's coffee related. So cute. Has all these different little scenes on here. And I, I just think that it was really fun. Cake and juice, better break, morning, relax. If it can be imagined, it can be created. There's always light behind the clouds. So I like those um, little sentiments on there. So I just picked up one of those. And that's going to go uh, on my coffee bar. So that was fun. And then uh, for the stationery... And other little items like that. I picked up quite a few things here. I, I did get some more of the um, 10 millimeter tape. So I had a couple of packages of these. And I like their, um, their adhesive tape there. It works really well. Um, I found this cute little bag. It's a little uh, clear zip bag. It's a little pouch. And I just thought it was adorable because it had the little um, glitter in here, the little shaker pieces, the little sequins, and it says fresh cherry. And so, you know, you can just put your little things in here, pack in your, your uh, luggage or, you know, in your purse, things that you don't want to get lost and, you know, so little small items. So I thought that that was cute. And then as I was going through the stationary uh, aisle, there was uh, an, an arts and craft two things over there. I picked up these cute little rhinestone uh, bows. And these are, um, you earn these on. So I got two of those. Really cute. And then for stickers, absolutely just adorable stickers. This one is, um, it's called Japanese Pattern Sticker. These are for the envelopes. And I love those little patterns and the words on there. Those symbols. Very cute. 
And then I found um, a couple of these little uh, stickers, and it says Queen's Tea Party. And this just reminded me of the Alice in Wonderland that you could probably use uh, for um, your journals. Just so cute. So I got those. And then I found this uh, really cute dessert stamp polymer. And I like the little uh, the little uh, images on here, baking and tea and desserts. It was really cute, and so got that one. And then I found these cards, these little thank you cards, and I liked the fact that it has the little um, cherry blossoms on here. Really, really pretty. A little message card. A little um, five, five by, um, by almost by five and five and a quarter, five and three quarters by uh, three, about three, almost close to four in size. And it comes with the envelope. So really pretty. Love that pattern. And it just simply says thank you. And so, now let me jump into the papers that I got. Um, this is actually, this paper here uh, it is called Mulberry Paper. And I cannot, for the life of me, Chirigami, Chayogami. But anyways, it's six different um, patterns in here. And it's almost, it has like that uh, rice paper feel to it and it is just really pretty like i said it's got six different patterns on in this one it's got the little tiny hearts so cute and then i got this paper and this is uh really pretty i like the plaids and their um the ginghams so different patterns and you get 60 sheets in this. It's really pretty. And this can be used all seasons. I picked up this paper here, which I thought was so cute. Um, it's got the little brick pattern. And let me turn on the back. It's got the, the brick pattern, the wood grain in two different colors. And then this... Um, inlaid of uh little bricks here and i just thought that that was adorable it's got that and then this really pretty again this uh chiogami paper it's almost like let's see i'll pull one out it's almost like um origami i think if you would if you want to say it like that but this is how it looks and I just was, I just thought that these uh, images are just so stunning. And then here on the back, um, not that one. Let's see. I got, oh, I know what I did. I got this one too. This one is a, um, this is a holographic foil um, origami paper. And this one has like the, um, the sea and the the uh, shells and the underwater type thing there. So I thought that that was really pretty. And then this one, this is uh, that's another one. This is uh, the one that I wanted to show you. Very very pretty. Uh, different patterns. That's what I was trying to show you on the back here. Very, very pretty. But I like this uh, this type of paper, you know, for just card making. Really beautiful. And so then uh, the next one I got was this uh, little baking uh, theme. And it has the little breads and the desserts. Really cute. So I love their papers. Now uh, I'll jump into... Uh, why I like going there too is for the bags. Uh, I picked up 
a few of these storage bags. And I like these little small ones because um, a lot of things you can put in here. Little small um, flowers or, you know, sequins mix. Any little thing that you want to, you know, if you want to share with any of your crafty friends. Small items. And then I got another size. This is a thicker storage bag with the uh, Ziploc. And I got different um, types. This one is postcard size. And then another one here. Um, again, good for small uh, items. And then this is uh, another storage bag. This one is more, um, this is like nine, almost nine and a half by 13. So really large bag that where you can combine a lot of um, things in, in your, um, in your uh, storage for papers and whatnot. I also got, this is a cute little bag. And I've already opened this one up and shared it with one of my crafty friends. Really pretty pattern. It says spring is here. And this is um, one of those gusseted bags. And it has a little tag that says, uh, especially for you, a little gift bag. And you can put all types of things in there. This one is another little bag I thought was so cute. This was called Fun Sea Life. And this cute little fish. So you can put snacks in here for the kids. Here's another one that says Hello Spring. And um, these, they call them frost bags with bottom gusset. And this one says Hello Spring, have a nice day. And it's got that little, uh, let's see, let me pull one out. It's hard to see. That cute little um, floral pattern on there. Really adorable. And then here's another one. This is a clear plastic one. It's just a simple one that says uh, keep smiling. It's got the little dots on there. And then, <laughs> again, I told you it's all about the bags in this video. Uh, this one is a, this is so adorable. It's like a little envelope. And it says, Beloved Honey. And I'll open this one up so that you can see how cute this bag is. It's like a clear little envelope. But it's a Ziploc. So you open it up like that. And put your goodies inside. But I just thought it was just absolutely adorable. So, love those. And then I got another uh, gift wrapping bag. This one says, today is a good day, personal happiness. And this has a little star pattern on there. And then it's got the little uh, open uh, handle bag here. Cute. And then this one, uh, this one is so pretty. It has like this little lace um, in, or, yeah, like a print on here. Really pretty. And then again, these are little treat bags. And then they give you the little tie uh, here to close it up. But it's, yeah, it's called a uh, clear plastic bag lace. And then for another uh, type of storage, I love these jar bags, and I've had these uh, before, but I've had them in the smaller size, so I did get some of those, um, and I got this size, really, really cute, and then I got two more, uh, another, um, for a six size card and then for the uh, B six size card and these are just clear pockets you can slide your cards in so those two sizes there 
And then last, I got this size. This is a bigger one. This is actually, a, uh, it says 8 and 3 eighths by 11 and 7, 11 point seven three and these are good for documents and um other larger items so that is my bag haul from Daiso I love going there when I get a chance and then when I do because I know there's not one that in, in the state that I live in. So whenever I get a chance to go, I always like to stock up on, on bags and unique items. So thank you for joining me today, uh, everyone. Take care, stay crafty, and we'll see you in another video. Bye-bye.